This fall, the focus is on the eyes, and makeup lines are jumping in with new products, such as feather eyelashes, vibrating mascara wands, and stick-on eyeshadow. They might seem like gimmicks, but makeup artist Thorsten Weiss showed us how to make them work. I've seen a lot of kind of focus on um, fake eyelashes and a lot of feathered eyelashes. Can you tell me what you think are, you know, what are some of the ways that you can wear some of these eyelashes? When you just hold it on and then you see um, how much, how big it is on your <laughs> eye. It's kind of drag queeny for me. So you shorten them, pluck them off, and take the single feathers. And if we cut them up, we have tons of more eye uses out of it. It feels nearly like an eyeliner without there is an eyeliner. It's just like, you know, open up the eyes very nicely. Yeah, I think that's really cute. Nice. So here we have the new mascara from um, Estee Lauder, the vibrant mascara. And how does it feel? It kind of tickles. I can feel it. It is, yeah. It makes the lashes vibrate and it kind of right. takes some getting used to. If you don't want to have too much mascara on. I mean, that's already a lot. Sometimes, new mascara comes on too heavy for daytime. I'm taking a dry one without any mascara or any product on, just to separate the lashes again. It's, it's pretty. It's like I said, I've never seen my lashes sort of this long. These are like stick-on nails, um, where uh, instead of sticking on nail and peeling it off, this is stick-on eyeshadow. You, you put it on your eye and you'll peel it off so you have a design so it does the work for you, essentially. Yeah, I think it's good to have someone who's helping you with that, <laughs> to apply and to paint it before you fix it. Because, you know, if you open it now, it's just like, it's just like smashed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I look like a lost member of KISS or something like that. <laughs> I think it might be interesting just to remove the uh, zebra mm -hmm. and um, to stay with the grey. The zebra brought us to the shape that it really fits for your eyes. This is a kind of a classical smoky eye. You can do very normal, simple eyeshadow if you want to have a kind of more dramatic eye for the evening could be this. So thank you, Thorsten, for walking us through some of these products for fall. That's fun. <laughs> Thanks for having me here <laughs> for that. <laughs> I learned a lot, actually. I, I think I too. too. <laughs> 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 for next time. Um, this has been Alva Ramirez for The Wall Street Journal. <laughs>